Hello YouTubers. Hi. Um I wasn't going to do a video but seeing that um I came across this um twin I'll call it a full twin bunk bed that I I got from Sears. Well, it's I bought it through Sears. It's actually from Dorel Living. I hope I pronounced that right. There it is. And um, I must say it's a it's a really good quality bed. It's made of solid pine wood, and you can I must I have to say I I call it universal because you can either use it separate. It's a full bed and a single bed. You can use it separate or you can mount it on top of each other to you know accommodate whatever space you have. Um, it comes in this son of a gun this long box and i must tell you the packaging oh my god i love the packaging i looked at it maybe about for half an hour that is oh i was going crazy i'm a sucker for packaging and um you know it's heavy as hell and thank god my my fiance he was home he he collected it. Even the UPS guy was like, damn, you know, we were on the first floor in our apartment. And um, he was like, you know, you saved me a ton. Because to haul this bugger up a stairs, it would be like, who hauling a casket? So like this dead man, got he got to be dragged in. So, um, yeah. So the packaging was really nice. You know, it's, everything is wrapped with styrofoam and these kind of little, I don't know what you call them, these pretty little white bags. So every piece came in, you know, its own little package. It was really well done. Kudos to whoever came up with this. And as I said, it's it's worth the money. I personally waited for it to go on sale because I have a budget and I needed it to stick in, but in within my budget. So yeah, my fiance and I, we did this together. And first things first, when you're about to do this, you need to separate the parts, the parts for the full size bed. You got to put that by itself, get that out of the way. And the parts for the single size bed, you got to put that on another side by itself. Or you'll be just going crazy looking at parts and be like, what the hell am I going to do? So, yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah, so as I was saying, um, yeah, so this is it. This is the finished product of the full size bed. I um, decided to do the single one by myself because my fiance found that I was stressing him out. So I showed him that I can do it on my own. And as you can see, hey, this is as far as I got. That's the ladder there. As I said, it put the pieces together. That's what I did. So you're not going to be confused by what's going where. It's already spaced out, put aside, and made stuff a whole lot easier. So, yeah, that's a lot of there. Um, I'm definitely going to put this on top of the other one. I'm going to mount it up. That's with this packages. This packing, sorry. Yes, those four studs there are what's going to be, you know, securing the single bed on top of the full bed. So, it's like a two for one package. As I said, I waited for it to go on sale, but it's worth the price. It's a solid pine wood. And as I was telling my, my fiancé, this will last until you're great, 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 great if you want it to. Unless you have some reckless kids who just don't care. And they're just going to break stuff. But ain't that. And my apologies. Um, my battery died. Um, as I was saying, you know, this is a really good product. as It can last you a long time as long as you don't condone or have reckless kids. Um, this will last you a very long time. It was not made in the U.S. And, um... I know some people are saying, but oh, you don't bash the U.S., but if that's where you got to go to get good products, that's where you got to go. I've been here in the U.S. for three years, and um, I've seen a lot of crap. And coming from a background where I have built furniture from scratch, this is really good, well done. All screws are in place, no shakes, no trimmers. Um, one thing I must point out, there's a locking system in the base um, for the baseboard of the bed. That's here. You need a... Philip head screwdriver or a flat head screwdriver holding the inside in place as you can see there and you turn the outside it can, and you there's a little trick we've just have discovered you gotta slightly lift 
the pressure of the screws because you find out it's, it seems to be a little stiff or it feels like it's not going in, but it actually gets in there when you do that and it works itself in. Right, so using those three tips, it makes it a whole lot easier. And um, these are the safety bands for the bed. The side bands, um, you don't need measuring tapes. They have a marked punch holes. It's on both sides of the bed. That's the single bed. And um, you line it up and you screw it in. And for those of us who want it to be permanent, you can add glue to your plugs and permanently secure it. Or for those of us who like to move a lot, you don't need to. And a little tip from the letters, you know, over time you will get old. You just mark, as you see I did there, mark them out. So if you do decide to move, you won't have a problem in the future. And that's about it. As I said, you know, I would re recommend this bed for anyone and you can't go wrong. Okay, this is my, you know, my very first video and I just wanted to share it. I was very much excited about this and yeah, it's something to really invest in. Okay, thank you.